I got slapped by my insurance leader. Alright, and Charlu here. And at some point of my career, I was an insurance agent. Alright, and as an insurance agent, there are two aspects to that. There's one which is the one which is like sales, personal sales, where you need to go and find uh, insurance clients and they pay the premium and you get a sale, okay? So that's part one. The second aspect of being an insurance agent is recruitment, where you get to be, uh, like you can start building towards being a leader or building towards uh, agency, a uh, unit manager or agency manager, okay? So this is where your recruitment comes in. So on my end, right, I would spend 10% on sales and 90% on recruitment. Okay, just a side note, if that's what you're doing, focus on your sales first before you do your recruitment. Because I know insurance companies, they want you to recruit because uh, they want more sales. Okay, ultimately, it's all for them. Um, but I, if you, for you, I would rather you focus on your sales first. Okay, anyways, back on topic. How did I get slapped by my insurance leader? Okay, and uh, one, one day, okay, one day, um, we were having a leader meeting, okay? We called it the Potential Unit me uh, potential unit Manager uh, Meeting, okay? P-U-M. And uh, we were discussing how to recruit more. So I was ranting and I was bitching and said, uh, why people don't uh, understand that insurance is the best industry to earn your income, okay? They can earn so much. Why they don't want to join me, all right? And for me, I had, uh, I was a uh, very like uh, arrogant. Okay, I was, I was arrogant. I was proud, um, and I came across like a asshole. Okay, that you know, what I mean, it's like why, why don't they see my point of view? What makes them so so clever and stuff like that, right? And that's where uh, one of the insurance leaders. Okay, he's same age as me. Um, very successful guy. Okay, successful guy. And that's where he told me this. If being uh so being an insurance agent can earn a lot of money right yeah how about you well i tell you uh, that one that one question alone got like it, it just shut me up it's like oh yeah because i did not have my result i did not have my sales uh i was like talking out of uh you know you know like like blowing my own horn uh just talking big talking cock you know arrogant and stuff like that i didn't know the journey back then i didn't know the journey to be successful i'm just like you know just just like talking cock lah, all right and that's where i realized that i learned a lesson where i need to be real i need to be humble i need to be vulnerable so rather than uh, rather than faking when I'm meeting someone like house insurance uh, can do one you can earn a lot of money uh, this is the best industry and that shifted me to after what my leader what my insurance leader told me back then was here's how I shifted uh, if someone asked me like why how how are you doing I'll just say I'm just starting out um, okay um, I'm still working on it and I'm here because okay so that's how I, just how I said it. it it really gave me uh, a, a sense of humility it, it made me humble so be real so if you are like in insurance or let's say if you are in recruitment so you like property or insurance or network marketing and health beauty or education or whatever recruiting uh, whichever recruiting thing you're in right now remember to be humble Remember, <laughs> humility. Don't be an asshole like me last time. All right. I, 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 up to this point, that one sentence, I know it was a slap. I appreciated it. I, I, it, it's up to this point. It's still with me. Always be real. Be honest. Be humble. And that's where I am today. Okay. And right now, I'm, an ed I'm in a network marketing in an education industry. We have a team at this point. I think we have more than uh, three. To, I think three to four hundred could be more. I'm not sure. Team, okay, team members. And always remember, the journey to success is a humble one. It's a very humbling journey. Um, just go with it. And if you ever you feel like there's ups and downs, ups and downs along the way, it is designed to be that way this is a journey to success all right anyway Sean Lui here and hopefully hopefully you like my short story this is true story by the way and if you like it you know feel free to subscribe to this youtube channel or feel free to subscribe to my youtube channel or uh, like my page on facebook links are in the description okay all right bye bye and i will see you in the next video